You still got a problem with us working alongside Valerian? <sighs> Manx turned out to be a ruthless dictator, but that shouldn't automatically condemn his son. I followed you through hell and back, sir. I'm not quitting on you now. Good man. This truce won't last forever. Just long enough to get the job done. On a personal note, nice job with Tychus. That ass-kicking's been a long time coming. Well, Junior, we got our hands on the final artifact. You can take possession of the whole set at any time. Thank you, Commander, and well done. You're every bit as resourceful as I've been led to believe. I think the odds are stacking in our favor. You better hope so. Delivering this artifact thing right to Kerrigan's doorstep. We're gonna need all the luck we can get. Rest easy. We'll have the might of the Dominion fleet behind us. Right. How you holding up down here, Chief? Better, now we got our old commander back. Oh, and our new best friend, Prince Charming, came through with some upgraded battlecruiser schematics. I've been working on some interesting modifications for our ships. I'll check them out. Where we're going, we're gonna need all the firepower we can get. She is my man. How can I be helping you, Mr. Rayner? You sit up here watching everything. Tell me what you see. Tyke is just a mean drunk. I wish it was just that. All that jealousy and rage. He's fighting himself over something he don't want to do. You'll see. This is Donnie Vermillion, live from UNN Studios on Core Hall. Troubling news tonight, as Crown Prince Valerian seems to have gone missing. That's right, Donnie. Prince Valerian was scheduled to speak at the launch of the Dominion's newest battlecruiser, the White Star. But the ceremony had to proceed without the Prince when he failed to arrive. Official government sources offered no comment. Whatever the situation, we here at U... Ready to tell me what the hell that was all about? Man, these last few weeks, helping you fight the good fight, I finally got a taste of what real freedom is. But that's all coming to an end with you charging off like some damn hero for a cause I couldn't care less about. Then what was all that talk earlier about doing humanity a favor and getting paid well in the process? It just seems the closer we get to your Queen of Blades, Let's just say things don't always work out the way you plan, Jimmy. I need you with me on this one, Tigus. Trust me. For old time's sake. All right, all right, I'm with you. That's my boy. Old times. Everything is in motion to begin the final act. The invasion of the primary Zerg Hive on Char. Once we begin, there will be no turning back. Ensure that you are fully prepared, Commander. Destiny awaits. Char, if hell ever 
existed, this is it. Oceans of fire, tectonic storms, and an atmosphere that'll burn a man alive. But we've planned for all of that. You can't plan for the Zerg, General. They ain't gonna fit into your nice, clean timetable. I've led five separate invasions against the Swarm. I held the line while you and your terrorist friends hid under a rock. We're all aware of your victories, General. I've invited Commander Raynor here to assist us with any unforeseen contingencies. Well, it sounds like you got it all figured out, Junior. I have far too much invested in this undertaking to see it fail. Speaking of which, you might particularly enjoy this next step. Valeria, I've just received a report you've taken half the fleet. Care to explain yourself, boy? Father, I am about to accomplish that which you never could. Today, I will defeat the Queen of Blades and secure peace throughout the Dominion. By this act, the people will finally know that I am a worthy successor to you. I love your gumption, son, but you're in way over your head. What makes you think you have the experience to... He ain't alone, Arcturus. Reyna. I don't know what gutter my son fished you out of, but even you've got to realize that treacherous bitch cannot be saved. And neither can you. We'll see about that. And when this is over, you and me got a score to settle. Everything I could have hoped for. You're playing a dangerous game here, kid. Prince Valerian, we have Zerg attack waves incoming. Already? wasn't gonna work. She was playing with us the whole time. Well, brother, we're alive at least. Looks like the few battle groups that did make it to the surface scattered all over the place. Do you think death is the worst thing that can happen to you here? Infestation is what's coming for you. Soon all will serve the swarm. She's trying to get in our heads, man. <sighs> Gotta keep it together. If we're gonna pull this caper off, we need to rally as many survivors as we can. Commander, Dominion battle groups are still landing all around you, but they're in pretty bad shape and coming under heavy attack from the Zerg. All right, let's get out there and rescue their sorry butts. We need to pull together a real fighting force, but we won't have a prayer of stopping Karen.
big job, huh? Sir, I'm tracking an incoming drop pod. It should be landing close to your position any second. All right. Let's get out there and find him before the Zerg do. FTV ready. Say the word, baby. Why not? Detected a drop pod in your vicinity. Gateway coming through. Outstanding. Go, go, go! Roger that. Coordinates to a nearby drop pod. Been waiting on you. Gangway, coming through. Of course. Sure. Outstanding. What's 
factory back to the landing zone and get it building. Go on, Something on your mind. Go ahead. Sir, another drop pod is coming down near your location. You gonna give me orders? By the numbers, boys. Aye, aye, sir. Roger that. Field depleted. Yes, sir. Well, butter standing by. You up, ready to go. Another drop pod has arrived near your perimeter. I'm dealing with Affirmative. Speak up! By the numbers, boys. 10-4. Looking forward to it. Power is just what we need. Secure this starport and bring it behind our guns. Await the orders. Right away. Ready to come.
Mayday, Mayday, this is General Warfield. My ship has taken terrible, terrible damage. Entering the atmosphere. I don't think you'll have enough time to rescue them all. Not with this much Zerg in the area. Damn it. We'll rescue as many as we can. But I don't think everyone's gonna look through this. Come in, see. Yay, one minute. 
Like old Warfield still alive and kicking. Needed some help. 
We came as fast as we could. There ain't no time to be lying down on the job, General. You magnificent son of a bitch. <laughs> You're the last man I expected to see. Boys, I hate to interrupt, but uh, the natives are getting restless. Thanks for the rescue. But I hope it ain't just the two of you. General, you know I've always got a card to play. You might be a damn pirate, Raynor, but whatever happens, you saved my boys today. And I won't forget that. All in a day's work, General.